Look, we're live. We're talking about Master Future <laughs> Podcasts. Same thing. <laughs> That's what a podcast is. I mean, a bunch of people named Matt saying things. Right, like the, the Council of Matt. Right. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if it already existed, to be honest. It almost certainly does. Welcome. He thought I was going to vamp longer. <laughs> so he's like, I've got to drink a tea. Yeah. Nope. Matt's never talked for less than 90 seconds at a time. <laughs> it's impossible. Um, hey, everyone. We're here for some reason. This is the morning. We're doing two sessions today. That's why you're here. That's why we're here. I don't know why you're here. It's a mystery. It remains a mystery. But everything with mysteries are good. Good movie. Uh, so. We're here to do two sessions of the finale of the Sentinel Comics role-playing game in one day. I'm going to keep yeah. talking until Jody can read. So what we're going to do today is some cool stuff. We did GM prep yesterday, in case you missed it. Adam and I usually do GM prep now, and then there's a session later. We're obviously not doing that. We did GM prep yesterday, and now we're doing a session. We're going to take a pause for maybe 20 minutes, everyone pees, that kind of thing. We'll take a pause in the middle after the fifth issue and then we'll lead into the sixth issue. So that's how that'll go. But before we do that, I want everyone to kind of recap what happened last time. Adam wasn't here last time, so we can just explain to him what happened. Recap to Adam. Yeah. So, uh, we had a team meeting on the flight to Strasbourg uh, mm -hmm. to hash out our differences, and mm -hmm. I, I think we came out stronger. Uh, the We're gelling well. Did you also come yes. out better and faster? Yes. A little bit, yeah. Just curious. Uh, that issue, that by the, the way, was named... The last uh, issue. Okay. The, the escalator is baby steps because I, I think that that's entirely appropriate to the progress. Where's your we logo? Make. You have a totally sweet oh, escalator. Yeah. Yes, it was on the screen actually. Too. Oh, nice. Yeah. Uh, so on the flight to Strasbourg, there was a storm, which we had to overcome using our various uh, strengths. Um, Some more literally than others. Yes, yes. You uh, manhandled the plane. <laughs> yeah, I got, I got and to. I uh, dealt with the lightning with the help of the concept artist and bubbles. And you got an epic cover photo out of it. Oh, yes, yes. absolutely. The, next album. the funniest thing to me about that situation, by the way, which I didn't tell you, is that I had some sweet major twist planned for when it messed up. <laughs> and then you didn't get major twists in that situation. No, that one we just handled. Right, no, like, it was no, fine. No, we just did it. It was just there. It was like, oh, okay, everything's good. <sighs> Let's roll infinite. Even, even <laughs> without doing major twists, we managed to disrupt you. Yeah. I love it. No, it was delightful. Uh, so the UN wanted us to find out what was going on in the land that used to be Strasbourg and was now covered by a black cloud of nothingness. Mm -hmm. So we went in under the Rhine and came up into a weird uh, glowing landscape of vector lines and uh, retro art where we basically punched things until it mm -hmm. was solved and yeah, found out very little. That is, I think, a very we accurate description. We tried very hard to do the <laughs> yeah, very we went, calculating. We were like, let us have a plan, and then we we're like, oh, that's not us. That's not how we work. That's not us. Mm -hmm. We figured out how we work, which is the way we always worked. Right. Things escalated quickly, <laughs> and then we were back to where we usually are. So anyway, there was the si the, there was Siberia and, like and the Siberian orchestrator, yes. which we yes, promptly <laughs> broke and found out some information from it, uh, namely that some information was being stolen from the parliament and being transferred uh, transferred rather to uh, Antarctica, mm -hmm. which is where we're going now. Mm -hmm. And since it's a very tiny place, mm -hmm. it will be very easy to find out. But yeah. most notably to me is that Strasbourg was just fine and this was some weird overlay thing. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, Strasbourg mm -hmm. came back fine. It was yeah. all good. Honestly, this is the thing that we've broken the least that in is the course true. of our yeah. adventures. Yeah. So you had your deep conversation and then didn't break everything. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it was a good day. Don't yeah. get used to that. Yeah. No. Not like today. We're going to break everything today. Yep. Major Antarctica is going to melt anyway, so Listen, if you can't This is going to be a long right. session. <laughs> or we can all die. I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe we all die? Maybe we play the way Matt plays games? Maybe we all play the way Matt plays <laughs> the games. The fifth issue is all of our characters dying. The sixth issue is us making new characters. <laughs> Hit points are a resource to spend. Speaking of which. I was just yeah. going to ask that. How long is this flight? Yeah. So I. Or how are we getting there? I'm going to. On a plane that, we can fly? that you're getting there on a plane. Sure. You're gonna fly from Strasbourg into McMurdo Station down there, and that's where the UN has set up a base. Mm -hmm. uh, you're gonna be met by uh, Matthew Spain once you get there, and he will. <laughs> sure. He will there. take care of you. Do you have a podcast? <laughs> yeah, yeah uh, absolutely. No, he's on the same one. The the one that we met in mm -hmm. uh, on the outskirts of Strasbourg was I, I think well, I want to say Frank Lichtenstein. I think it was Luke Lichtenstein. Thank you, Mark. Yeah. Mark, oh, Mark Lichtenstein. Lichtenstein. Oh yeah. How was I the one that wrote something I'm down? Sorry? Uh, I, you should not be relying on me is what I'm saying. 
The, the guy who you met previously was named Luke. It's John England. Is it Luke France? It is Luke France. Luke France. That's who it was. Yeah. Somebody, somebody Wales, right? Luke Wales. I'm sorry. Yes, you're right. Luke Wales. The problem with this joke is that I started making up this joke live and forgot to write it down. Right. <laughs> right. Correct. So I'm glad that we workshopped out That's this. That's important. Because now you are you're yeah. coming through the entire dumb joke I'm making. Yeah. Can't wait until we meet Ringo whoever. <laughs> right. Ringo Antarctica. <laughs> All right. So McMurdo Station. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, I will go through the And yeah. uh, something, someone Spain, who's his first name? Yeah, no, Matthew Spain. Matthew Spain. Mm -hmm. Ringo Spain, got it. <laughs> Do you get the joke of what oh, I did? Oh, I know what you're doing. All right. I, I don't, but I think it's funny. <laughs> this is a book. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> oh, oh, god damn it. <laughs> okay, yeah. Fine. It's a really dumb joke. All right, so <laughs> here we are. But before we start playing, so you're going to be on there playing your fight over there. You want to know uh, how your health is doing. Yeah, so yeah, because we're not on a lot of hit points. Well, some of us are. You are, I assume, going to get all the way up to the bottom of the green zone. Okay, cool. Before you start. Do that. That's all of us. Yeah, all of you, before you start oh. doing this stuff. It's right so, on the cusp. Yeah. So we're in the green, but at the bottom. Yeah, right. That works for me. Punch myself in the face. All right. <laughs> So before we get going, though, we're going to talk about the bits. Adam reminded me, if anyone is interested in doing the cheer thing, helping some people out, uh, it's oh, kind of fun. Saved our lives so you're right, it definitely yeah. did. Yeah, it <laughs> so did. yeah, we would have appreciated it. I still have one from last week. That's good. What one do you have? Lucas gave me one. Mm -hmm. Nice. You've got a plus one from Lucas. Mm -hmm. So if you cheer on Twitch, uh, 100 gives someone a plus one, 200 gives someone a plus two, all the way up to 400 giving someone a plus four. After that. Give up multiple things. It doesn't get you bigger bonuses and plus four, because that's kind of ridiculous. But you can give them to anyone. And that includes these players. It's a good idea. Or me. Mm, it's a bad I'm idea. Awesome. I'm actually okay with it. No, yeah. it's, it's fun. But that's what we'll it's do. Fun. Also, it's So anyway, idea. so that's how that works. We so we break things when we're enough on our Right, yeah. So, so <laughs> right. Any, if, if anyone feels like doing that, Adam will transmit them on to us. Everyone here will have to describe kind of what they're doing with that. So Telepathically, that's how that works. he's going to do it. Yep. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to assume that by now, you're on this airplane. Is that, does that sound good? Is that where you want to be? Yeah, definitely. So. Is there, there's stuff, so last time, the last couple times, so now they're getting the technology better for making you not break airplanes when you're on them. Slowly, okay. slow improvements. Okay. You see from one issue to the next, the slow progression of this technology. It's pretty great. Uh, yeah. <coughs> two, two for each player. Oh, wow. Hey. Okay. Thank you, Lucas. Okay. Uh, so when you, when you use this, write that down, but when you use it, it's from Lucas, and you got to come up with a cool thing that it is. Yeah. Mm. Sound good. All right. So you're kind of traveling along. The last couple of times you were on a plane, though, you wanted to like do stuff or have talks or plans on the plane. No, we're just napping. Before you get in. But do you want to just nap? Like, Whatever you want to do, I want to give you an opportunity. You coalesced as a team. I, I feel like we're actually in a good place as a team. I don't want to screw it up, which will almost certainly happen no, if I start not, talking. If we talk at all, <laughs> it's going to mess things up. What can I punch? <laughs> um, yeah, no, like, uh, being in the weird vector zone has made me want to play retro video games, so that's what I'm nice. illegally downloading onto my phone. <laughs> and playing on From the space, yes. Nice. I'm, I'm, I'm working on Scavenger Bot, getting them back up to... Oh, nice. ...back up to snow. That's fantastic. I'm juggling bubbles. Sounds good. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, I'm, I'm painting. I've been highly inspired to paint um, something that kind of maybe looks like a if light you cycle. Know what I mean. Oh, nice. Very cool. Mm -hmm. I like it. Cool, so you're on the plane. It's just going. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is going to progress in real time. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> the plane just keeps going straight forward. Strasbourg to Antarctica <laughs> nonstop, I'm assuming. Yeah. It's, it's a, it's a, a custom chartered plane. Can we, so, I'm just going to, can we get, like, at least some intel from uh, Antarctica before we get there? Yeah, do you want to try He's to call it? To make a call it would be yeah. nice yeah. because, yeah, like, I, uh, as far as I know, our current plan is explore Antarctica for the foreseeable future. <laughs> I would like to narrow that down. Why? why? Yeah, it it's seems like you don't probably. you don't have a set. We don't know where Do they we, have any to points? find the thing to punch? They have nice fur coats. Yeah, they should once they're there. You don't have a satellite connection though right now. Ah. Hmm. Oh. That's a shame. Well, nope. There's no satellites case? left. Yeah, it seems like you've been traveling for a really long time. And nothing's happening. Let's go talk to the pilot and find out what's going on. Yeah, so you go in and talk to the pilot, and it, you must be in the clouds or something, because it's all white outside the plane. Oh, but the pilot is sitting there, and it looks like a statue. In fact, uh, it looks like, um, almost like a very 
realistic mannequin. Or like, um, have you ever seen one of those spy movies where someone gets dipped in maybe gold paint? It's like that, except puce paint. Ugh. <laughs> and as you walk into the cockpit and see that, named color. <laughs> slowly the entire airplane starts to dissolve around you. Cool. And um, vanish. And uh, it's probably fine. Everything so vanishes, and suddenly you are in a place that looks something like this. Perfect. That's what it's like. Adam, yeah, okay. Adam worked on this art, so you can see that there's a lot of. Uh, Mm. Whiteness okay. over here. Mm -hmm. There's a guy with mirrored shades in a seat right, in the and chair. it's just like kind of white over there. Polar bear in a snowstorm. And you see, that's what you see all around you, and you are now falling, and you're in free fall. Bubbles. <laughs> but out, song is playing. Song? out in the <laughs> distance, you see one point of something in color coming toward you, and as she approaches, she says, "I will stop you. It is I, Paisley Puce." <laughs> oh, so gross. Yay. Oh, good. Wow. <laughs> and she uh, whips out her like... hands, and she's got brushes in her hands. Oh, yeah. And she goes like this, and sends out ribbons of paint that come out. It's actually pretty cool. That's and so attack all of you. Yuck. Oh, good. <laughs> I... Oh, the Paisley that Paisley pattern color. is so good. Are we still falling, Walt? Yes, you are definitely falling. Oh, yeah. She is flying. You are falling. But there's I no, need a D10. There's no sign of anything beneath you us. No. D10. There's no sign of anything beneath so you. So we can just fall forever, and it's fine. That's what it seems like. Yeah. If there's no ground, there's no problem. <laughs> right. Oh. All right. You all take four damage oh. from the paint okay. ribbons. Now, <laughs> now who's in the yellow? All of us. We're all in the yellow. <laughs> are you, are you sad that you punched yourself in the face? It didn't have any effect. I'm also super durable. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And now. Oh, no. <sighs> Paul just cut out the middlemen, which is what we are usually. <laughs> and was just like, nah, we're just going to do this fight right now. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll break the plane for you. <laughs> So she goes, then she passes it to the scene tracker, and then she passes it off to you, who is falling down through the air. Oh, okay. Um, I feel like first we should probably stop falling. Yeah? We're good with this, or we want to fall forever? But are we actually falling? I mean, we've got melee combatants that can't really do anything unless I'm, we can I'm, actually yeah, get forever. through there. I kind of figured that, right? Because I can fly. You're fine. All right. Okay. So I feel like maybe we should paint some scenery in this vast blank canvas that we are currently falling Let's in. Paint, paint the ground, ground last. Yeah. <laughs> paint the ground slowly. <laughs> Very a long soft slope. How... The gentle curve at the end. So I, I'll, this is kind of elaborate though. Mm -hmm. How fast or and or slow? Like how many turns is it going to take yeah. me to to paint? I guess we really only a need reality a around us. <laughs> to, to, to paint reality. What we do really you want? only need a floor. I mean, yeah? it would take a long time to paint all of reality, yeah. obviously. No. I think Let's that's, that's safe floor. to say. That would be several start with the How floor. about we land on Not something. a glass floor. No, what if, what if we paint not reality, but a thing to stand on? You just want a pile on. of mattresses to land on. Uh, I mean, that's also fine. Jello. Um, <laughs> possibly bubbles. They seem to be working out for us pretty well. Uh, a floor of bubbles does seem like it would play to our strength. Some <laughs> some sort of just a giant floating trampoline. disc. <laughs> Something. Okay. Um, all right. Rocket so... boots, jetpacks. <gasps> you know exactly what jetpacks are like <laughs> from issue one. I do. <laughs> Wrap this all up. Great. All right. Um, I'm gonna start. I'm just gonna paint. Um... The ground, you all fall into it. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. I'm terrified if I'm like, right, I paint, I'm terrified of terminal velocity as well. I know. Like, I paint a brick floor and then we the all fall. the terminal part. <laughs> I like so... the jetpack idea, to be honest. There's just a speed at which the train station moves. Wings? Do you want wings? I mean, maybe. All right. Do you, you want wings? You should also you have wings. I feel like you're the one that also, like, should wings first. I mean, I could paint a ground, but if we'd all rather have jetpacks, okay, sure, got, why not? You gotta decide. You're gonna fall in this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> this is happening in real time. Oh, no. All right, we're gonna do. And you um, have to draw the wings in real time. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. All right, we're gonna do a uh, ground. Um, we're gonna do a floor of bubbles. 
very well connected bubbles, but enough to cushion our fall. Sure. Bubble wrap. So sure. like, we like a foam a mattress. Yeah. yeah. Like we enough that we can stand on them, but not enough that we're going to break anything yeah. if we fall. You can paint a floor <laughs> that's about a little bit bigger than this room of bubbles. Okay. That's a start. It's something. It's something. All right. So you're going to, it's going to be an overcome. Hi. Hi. <clears throat> All right. Tell me what you use. So I'm going to use creativity mm -hmm. and illusions. Well, time to see if we get our first major twist. And it is. Banter is the ground into existing. <laughs> I'm going to use that plus two from Lucas. Um, and I think this should be totally doable. Like, obviously, we've seen bubbles craft golems and everything out of uh, bubbles. True. So it's, I, have a, I have a very good knowledge of bubble physics and how to correctly draw a bubble floor <laughs> based on prior knowledge. Oh. All right. Um, so I'm using my plus two. So I've got a one, a 10, and a six. Yeah. So, so an eight. Right. So you just succeed. Yeah. No twists at all. Bam. Perfect yeah. bubble floor. And you all land and kind of is springy. So you like spring a little bit, yeah. but otherwise it cushions I don't you. land. I was fine. Oh, you were fine. That's true. You can just do that. Are you in a bubble? But you were like, I'm in a bubble. Bubbles. I have to be in a bubble. So you, 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 you yeah. hover bubble above the bubbles? Yes. yes. Nice. That is really great. So that's what's going on. So the three of you have landed on the springy bubble, springy bouncy bubble thing. <laughs> Floor. Good to know. Yeah. Bubble pit. But, bubble pit. But you're, you're kind of floating above it. Who's going to go next? Um, any preferences? None. None? Bubbles, you want to go? Sure. Why not? Right. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Did you... I'm going to, I'm still juggling these bubbles. I think this is your nemesis. What? <laughs> no, couldn't be. No. Um, so I'm still juggling. That Siberia was mine. <laughs> 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 the character made of technology. Probably, yeah. It could be, it could be. <laughs> Who fixed things that she was near. <laughs> so I'm going Wait. to um, continue juggling He's these the bubbles, and I'm going to throw one of them at each of you. Yeah. In an effort to boost you. Okay. Mm. A bubble um, boost, you might yep. say. Uh, I'm going to boost your bubble. And um, I've got a plus two from Lucas that I'm just going to burn right away. Yeah. Tell me why. Because, well, uh, what? Tell me why. Tell me how. Ain't nothing but... I mean, it was, it was part of the, the juggling the bubbles. Oh, like, you've been just juggling, yeah, yeah, the, entire been juggling the entire time. Yeah, I've been juggling the entire time. Like yep. She was juggling on the plane, yep. the plane disappeared, she's just right. juggling. It's yep. <laughs> like floating down juggling bubbles. So maybe they're better because you've been like working on them this entire time yeah. and putting yeah. more energy in them. And so, like yeah, so I get to... I unfazed about the plane disappearing around <laughs> oh, you. Oh, yeah, no, this, this sort of thing happens. Perhaps Earth technology does yeah. this sometimes. Right. right. I'm friends Which with mishap. Which is actually true around right. yes, yes, it is. <laughs> I'm friends with mishap. Works, works out. Yeah, bubbles like opinion of... I would like experience the weirdest perception of Earth. Like, all right, whatever. All right, <laughs> so <laughs> you will all get a boost equal to my max and mid die. Oh, plus two. Jeez. So my max is eight. Uh, my mid is six. That makes it fourteen. So it's sixteen. So it's it's plus, plus four. four. It's plus four. Which is what maxes out. You max. Wow. Uh, and I am hindered minus one. Oh, okay. Because this also hinders me. Right. So they get the boost. You don't get the boost. I get a hinder. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool though. Oh, that means I can hit you harder. <laughs> I mean, I'm yeah. Going to. You, you could. You could. Um, well, I mean, let's find out. Are you, you going to hit me at your turn? Oh. Okay. I don't know what I want to do. You're I on a bouncy about, bubble floor. I'm on a bouncy bubble floor. Mm. I definitely want to not be on. And you've got a bubble uh, that you can kind of do here's with what the you problem. want. If I move off of the bouncy bubble floor, do I start falling again? Yes. I assume this is like a bouncy so, bubble raft. In it is. It's a okay. floating bouncy bubble raft. Currently. Okay. Um, Sorry, I guess I should have given this walls. No, no, no. No, no, this is, I'm fine with that. Um, so I it turns want into a class. to. So I kind of feel like you more guys more. are all getting a, a sense of how these bubbles work now. Now I've seen somebody else make bubbles. Yeah. And like, <laughs> you can kind of do with what you want with these bubble balls. You can like make it grow and encase yourself in it and use it for mm -hmm. some defense thing, or you can throw it at something and attack with it. I. Uh, I'm going to play a dirge, and I'm going to hinder, <laughs> uh, and for added uh, uh, percussive impact, 
at the exact right moment, I'm going to pop the bubble. Uh -huh. So this will be plus four. So uh, this is Suggestion and Persuasion and a D8 plus four. What is your goal here? What's that? What is your goal here? What are you doing? I am going to hinder ah. uh, the Peace Princess. Yes. Paisley Peace. Paisley Peace. The Peace Princess. Princess. Paisley Peace. Peace. Paisley. God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do this. Sure. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to hinder using suggestion. I can apply it to multiple targets, so it's just the mid, but that's a seven. So that puts us at a minus two for her. Does that include your pluses? Yeah, it does. Okay, cool. So what is this minus two? Describe it. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, <laughs> nice. Uh, I start playing Colors of the Wind. <laughs> and uh, basically, uh, <clears throat> which, you know, has that... that that percussive impact, that, that big, the big <laughs> drum solo in the middle. Super. Here, minus two, colors of the wind. And uh, her ears are ringing from the pop bubble. That's good. That's good. It affects painters a lot. Specifically. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I think that's what I can do. In their ear thing. Yeah. And I, do you want it or do you, you want her to have it? She, um, she went already. Yeah, yeah she so, went oh, already. Right. a scene tracker, so. That's it, must go. Right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I'm a little bit concerned about this. So oh, yeah. I'm going to try and start hindering her because I don't want her to do things. Do things that are bad to us. So uh, Scavenger Bot and I are going to do some sweep in the leg. And I'm going to bounce on the bubbles using acrobatics. And then Scavenger Bot and I are going to try and hinder her while attacking her. So I attack using Scavenger Bot and hinder that same target using my Min Die. And I will be using this bubble to help me get around, and uh, if I can find a place to attack with it, I will. Cool. But I'm using the boost. So. Oh, those are much better numbers. Puts the right bubble behind her knees, pushes her over it. <laughs> so it's just an exercise bubble now. <laughs> so I'm gonna make this a 10 with my, with my throw of plus a ladder, four, and running nice. a different which bubble. means that this <laughs> is now my uh, min, and this is my mid, so I hit her for nine, okay. and I hinder her using my min die, which is eight. So that's Ooh. a minus three. Minus three. Oh, what is, what is, how, how are you hindering her? So scavenger bot is gnawing on her leg. Okay. Did you use your plus four? I did. Oh, nice. That's what I helped to springboard myself off and, gotcha. uh, you know, get handholds. Nice. The minus three from scavenger bot. So that is quite a lot right there. That's good. All right. Who are you going to pass it to now? You're at the end of the round. I'll pass it to the environment. Okay. Yep. So, the environment, it's just a scene dragger. It just goes. Because your environment is nothingness. Mm -hmm. Right? So there's no, no environmental twists at all that can happen. Because there's nothing to talk. But then, Paisley Puce goes. And Paisley Puce reaches for her paintbrushes. And very quickly paints a bunch of... Four puce pigeons. Good. <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> and she so sends gross. them flying at you. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, I'm sorry. That's actually just two puce pigeons because she has a minus two. Fingers. So the colors of the wind make her worse at <laughs> the, worse at painting puce pigeons. We should stop saying it. They're very litigious. <laughs> <laughs> the colors of colors. the colors. It's, but it's spelled O U R. S. Yeah. No, no. Like the specifically colors. the like literal actual colors of the actual wind. wind. Right. Yeah. Clear. Right. And all. Right. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> yes. Or no, possibly. So there's two puce pigeons, and they're flying at you. But now... Just in general, not in this game. Can you draw me a raccoon? Yeah. <laughs> She's going to pass it back to you. All right. Um, I was originally going to hinder her. So there's minus three from the scavenger bot, gnawing at her leg. What happens if we incapacitate her and we're still in this non-reality? <laughs> Yeah, I'll just pick one. Like, before we start... <laughs> can make a new reality. Pick a world, I'll paint it. Before. It's fine. I, reject, I reject your reality. <laughs> oh, no. I'm going to coffee trouble. Make your own reality. Blackjack. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I can wait to hinder her. I could attack Puce Pigeons instead. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You could mm -hmm. make your own 
I mean, she's your nemesis. You should just mirror everything she does, <laughs> but, but prettier. Right. But better. Here, oh, God. It's, um, it's um, the color of every 80s living room carpet. <laughs> yes. Dusty Rose, the we, character. We oh. had a uh, couch set color, also. Oh. And same as the carpet? So it was hidden? <laughs> it was camouflage. It was and now I'm imagining different shades of puce, but like camo. Ugh. I mean, it's on there. Oh, terrible. <laughs> All right, I'm going to... Paisley's just... 60s camo. <laughs> Specifically, it's what you paint something, like what you paint the 60s so that you can't see it. You're right. <laughs> All right, I will hold off on specifically hindering her until next turn, that's fine. Uh, instead, I will attack using Brainstorm. Okay. Um, and I can hit one target using my min, another target using my mid, and then boost using my max. So I'll do this toward the two puce pigeons that we have All over right. there. Um, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna use my boost. Do I have to use that boost from no. Bubbles right now? I'm gonna you wait not. then. You can totally save it. Okay, I'm gonna hold on to it then. I, I'd, I'd request that you hit her directly. I can do a thing with one of the minions that will like make it attack someone else. And we have, like, can also we, we can deal with minions. minions. Oh, okay. I can eat them. <laughs> or at least make them eat, the, eat each other. I can also accidentally um, you don't have attack good pigeon meat is. <laughs> no, so. no, I don't. No, nope. not a, uh, that's well, no. definitely not a thing I know. So, do you want me to attack life. her and a pigeon? I, I think yeah. If, if that's if that's something you want to do, but like I think that I think she's a priority. Because I can you are uniquely of suited if to someone would like a boost. Otherwise, I can just hinder her again, and. I mean, I, I think that attacking this is, is the way to yeah. go. Okay. When doves fry. <laughs> <laughs> Show over. I'm out of here. Ball, you win. You know what? Just, just tear this up. I'm done. <laughs> the most perfect possible joke occurred to me about that. It's so, oh, God. It's so much it's better than you know. Oh. All right. If I'm attacking her, then I will use my, I'll use my boost. Um, I'm still going to use That's brainstorm. That's the funniest thing I said. Like. <laughs> the funniest thing anybody's ever said. Oh, <laughs> All right. That's right up there with Jamira Cry, Jamira Cry video burial ground. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> so it requires so much explanation. You <laughs> rope. I think this is a realistic portrayal of how RPGs tend to go. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Which is that you make dumb inside you make jokes, jokes that are just for you. Yeah, yeah. The only thing that we don't have here that would, like, to achieve greater verisimilitude is we'd have to have, like, a lot of snacks. Tortilla yeah. chips. Yeah. Right. right, yeah. Mm -hmm. But it turns out tortilla chips and lab mics don't Right, mix. exactly, right. I mean, they do. Well. Like, really, really badly. <laughs> <laughs> like that time Jody tried to make a cocktail. <laughs> <laughs> Out of the, chips and microphones? No, it was the Absolute Zero, which was blue curacao, because blue, and Rumpelman's. So, right, because that's toothpaste and orange juice. Yeah, no. The cocktail. That's the worst thing. Why would you do that? Right. Mine is Absolute Vodka and nothing else. Absolute Zero. Yeah. <laughs> it's a tumbler full of Absolute Vodka. <laughs> what actually happened in this game? No. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's bring it around. No, you're fine. <laughs> So we've learned a valuable lesson about not starting <laughs> this early in the morning so when we're all a little bit loopy. Oh, okay. Oh, it's been a long all right, week. I can or maybe hit. we should because this has been. <laughs> who knows? It's been I a long several one. months. <laughs> it's been a very long week. I can hit one with a min die. My okay. my min die is a three. So. Okay. And then another target good. with my mid die, but I have a plus four. Nice. So um, my mid becomes an eight. And so the eight will obviously go to Paisley, Paisley Puce, Puce, and the three will go to the Puce Pigeons. And <coughs> so um, I craft um, out of the sky, um, you just hear this large um, screeching, and then these giant talons come in, and uh, Paisley is being attacked by an eggplant eagle. Nice. 
<laughs> and then an eggplant. I didn't go to the color at first. Right. It was like. I feel weird. Like, oh, no. I have They're to very stay. bulbous. The eagles are <laughs> streamlined. Oh, okay. And then another eagle goes for one of the it's puce of pigeons. Penguins. All right. I mean, you could really like go so the more puce pigeon obscure and go ecru. Gets a seven. So it hey. scales down. So survives. It yeah, goes D6. down to uh, yeah. ah. 100 d6s. No, you need, yeah, you need d6s. There. What if we just throw a bunch of dice? Excellent. Our, we're playing an RPG, yeah. What if? An <laughs> excellent eggplant eagle. That's exciting. Cool. <laughs> I'm ready to get children to work in my head. All right, <laughs> who's going next? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what is happening? Uh, I can do a thing? Or yeah, yeah. Do yeah. A thing. Oh, first with the plan. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's do that. <laughs> so, I'm going to Wrecking Ball the D8 minion. And have you ever used Wrecking Ball before? I have not. That's why oh. I wanted to use it. Because all what, the minions have generally been dead. Explain it. Tell so, me more. I don't know what I'm going to do is uh, Scavenger Bot's going to come back from the, the leg. Yep. Uh, leaving, of course, bite marks many bite and, marks and many hindering things. Uh, but Scavenger Bot and I are going to go after that Paisley Pigeon, and we're going to knock it into something else. So whatever it rolls on defense, it attacks a target of my choice with. Cool. Even if it dies. Nice. So. Uh, and this is the big one you're going after? Uh, yes. Nice. So scavenger bot and acrobatics, because I really can't get around on this without bouncing around and using acrobatics. And, oh, no, I'm not using acrobatics. I'm using close combat because I specifically have to use close combat. And a d8. All right. So getting in close to a puce pigeon and whacking it into something else. And that is not that great. It could be worse. It could be worse. It would be very difficult for it to be worse. <laughs> because I rolled a two. So let's see what it rolls on defense. And even if it succeeds and gets better. Five. So it attacks Paisley Puce for a five. Oh, and then okay. Downgrades. Nice. That worked well. And it dies? No, it downgrades. They're downgrades, right. That's what I thought. So it saves. Wait, there's some weird thing where... Sweet. Okay. Cool. I like to think that it just sort it's of splats into her. You don't need more I don't than three. Who are you passing to? Uh, who wants it? I mean, I, I can go. You might need. I can always attack. Yeah. Go for it. Um, I want to change that. To cool. I'm going to use uh, burst your bubble, which att uh, attacks multiple Just targets using bubbles. <laughs> yeah. Uh, mid die gets each target, and uh, then I take damage equal to the max die. So um, bubbles and alertness. Are you using bubbles? Have you ever yeah. used bubbles before? No, it's, oh, okay. it's, it's a new one for me. Yeah. Um, and then status die. Um, and then I have a Six. negative for my thing I did last time. So they all get an attack of four against them. Against all of them? Yeah. Wow. Does that include Paisley Peace? It includes Paisley Peace. They survive. And I get an attack of six against me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. Not ideal. It's all right. I used up my, my hinder. No, it hits pays the yeah. piece also. Oh, okay. So, and then uh, Matt's the only one left. Unless we want her to go? Nope, she she's already her. gone. Sharon went straight. Mm. Okay. Hmm. I was distracted by the puce color. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to go after one of these pigeons because um, I didn't like um, taking a nap um, before yeah. in, in a previous session where. I didn't get to play that much because kind of I died right in the right. round. Um, so I'm going to attack using strength because this is important to a thing and close combat, which is also a d8 and another d8. There's three d8s. Um, and I'm going to ask this before I do this. Yes. Am I going to fall? Do I know? It doesn't matter. If you get off of the platform. Yeah. Get off we'll find out. Yeah, I'm gonna bounce off that platform and yeah. attack a pigeon. Heck yes! At a pigeon. Rather. At the pigeon. Yeah, because yeah. I, I want to eliminate a pigeon. Uh, yeah, that's a three. Yep, it's a three. Okay. It's a high roll for that pigeon. It's a yeah. high roll for the pigeon. It, it does it. It did it. <laughs> but it was a high roll for that pigeon. So it lives. So you oh, hit it with a three. And it, as you go past, you hit the pigeon. I should use Lucas. It seems to be all right, but then you just keep arcing. And you keep falling, and now you're going. You, you made a good ballistic trajectory. It's a parabola. You're going like this, cool. and you keep falling. Since a new Free. album cover. 
free falling. <laughs> right. Free uh. fall. <laughs> Uh, so that's what you're doing over there. Avenge me! <laughs> <laughs> She's totally not to avenge him. I like how the justification... Why harder? I like how the justification of this was, I didn't like it the time that I died. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to jump off this cliff. No, because you didn't get to choose that time. Yeah, yeah. Right. This, is the, this, is, this is mine. This is sure. of my own volition. <laughs> so, who, so you're at the end of the round. You're going to pass it. You just start off the next round. Uh, I'm going to pass it to... Bubbles. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> that seems wise. Seems like a good call. So, um, oh goodness. So yeah, I see there's some falling friends, mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, I definitely need to stop that. <laughs> That's fine. As best I can. And so I I'm only gonna, fall on my turn. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do an overcome Hopefully. with bubbles to mm -hmm. try to encase them in a bubble, and. Um, Probably alertness, because I saw that happen, question mark. And then my status die. And um, this seems important. I'm going to use my plus four from last issue. <laughs> All right. Seems important. Seems important. Um, so I get to use my max die, which is yeah. a four. And then I add four to it, which is an eight. It just succeeds. Oh, you, nice. You're so in yeah. a bubble. Boom. You're and in a bubble. And we all get a hero point. That's good. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, you do. Oh, that, that was, won't matter because we're going to catch those in. That was the second time I did. Uh, no, it wasn't. I assume we're going to have the midterm. Yes, you are. Because yep. it would be the midterm. two issues. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that what they call it? Yeah, the midterm. Intermission. No, it's the midterm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to retest. That's going to count for 40% of your grade. Look, that's why I've been taking the notes. I registered with 50. That's why I've been taking the notes. Yeah. It's so that I won't fail. It's an open book test. The midterm and the final are both 40% of your grade and the other 20% of class participation. And so, yeah. So, who are you going to um, pass it to next? I was, was I the first one or were you the first one? This you round? were first. This you were first. Yeah. Okay. Um, so you can gonna, pass it to literally anyone. I, I'm going to give you a chance to, to get out of where I don't know that I can do anything inside the bubble. You've just prevented me from falling. You, you think could, so? You can rock out. Right. Like, I can, I can play the hits. Right. Yeah. I definitely, that's true. I can play the hits. You can find from there. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. I don't know if I want to waste it on a D4. <laughs> but it's really tough D4. I okay, that's fine. Um, all of reality. <laughs> I will pass it off to Jen. Okay. Um, the last thing I need to do is feed him a major twist. Or a minor twist. See, that's that's red. <laughs> no, that's the first thing you need to do. There hasn't been a major twist this whole yeah, I know. trick. I know. What are we doing? Dis what, are, dis what have we done? Not enough overcomes. More um, overcomes. I'm gonna... <laughs> it's working. I'm gonna roll just an, let it work. <laughs> I'm going to roll an overcome to flap my arms. I figured you just pied Piper one of those. Hold on to it. Get no, it to five 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 pied Piper <laughs> both of them and then tie them to my belt. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. I'm going to do a hinder on Paisley Puce. All right. Tie more. Piper her eagle. So, it says minion. You could. It's not a minion, is it? Yeah. It my, is. Yeah. yeah. What is it? What died? Oh, that one wasn't a minion. That, that was just no, a that that was just said. Yeah, You can make minions. And then you could pipe Piper them. Like, that's real. Yeah, shouldn't. That's Dang. ridiculous. That seems stupid. Do you have enough bubble golems? Yeah. Nah. <laughs> Slows the game down a lot. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to hinder using creative block. All right. Um, so let's see. Illusions and creativity and yellow. Let's see how this goes. I don't have any bonuses, so we're going to see what happens here. Oh. There's just a mid, right? Yeah. Where did my thing go? So five? Five. five which is minus a five. minus two. Yep. What is this? And it is exclusive and persistent. Um, so. <laughs> you tie an anvil to her. So a giant paintbrush comes out of the sky. Yeah. And it goes up to her and it just starts going. <laughs> And it changes her from puce to um, <laughs> a lovely shade of sky blue. <laughs> oh, it wasn't another pea color? Go, go print one of those. Oh. No, sorry. <laughs> Get on that. I'm sorry, we'll just take the red toner out of the printer and print another one. All right, so, so yeah. now she's got scavenger bite marks and sky blue paint. Yeah. Kendrick here. I like the idea, remember this in the future, that scavenger bite just has like a bear trap. And then, like, <laughs> when it hinders, it just leaves the bear trap. And then another one goes, sink. <laughs> it just has a, a, a magazine of bear traps. It, it, it's like shark teeth. Like, right, just, right, right. It, it just leaves the old one. Pop right in the place. And it's a, exactly a cartoon bear trap that okay. comes out of its mouth. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you think this isn't cartoonish? 
I like it. And since that is persistent, I assume that every time she changes herself yeah. back to Puce, yep. it if just paints former, her again and yes. makes her. If the former it can just rotate was through colors. Justice, Anything. Oh, this is Saturday morning sentinels. Yep. Go. I like it. This is Saturday very, morning sentinels. Pink, blue, pink, blue. Pink, I like it. You're a bunch of goofballs. Who are you going to pass it to? I'm going to pass it to. Ooh, good note. Let's see. You've been watching. No, I didn't know he's trying. It's harmonizing. Do you want to <laughs> try something, or do you need? Oh, I can. Yeah, I can. I can galvanize. That's that is a like worthy that. thing to do. That okay, a good choice. Do for that before everyone went. <laughs> no, but like you'll get it for another round. Yeah, I know, but we would have had it for two rounds. Right, but, but he can galvanize, and then Mishap can use it to do some sort of oh attack. Not right. I'm not even out. That sounds like a thing I could do. I play, so, yeah. I play the hits, and then pop the bubble, and I'm just like. Oh, you're galvanized forever. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Do we're gonna that do this. Thing. I'm gonna do that thing. Uh, suggestion, persuasion, and I'm gonna use Lucas's plus two because I have the perfect song for this to instill, you know, uh, uh, <laughs> energy into my friends. And I'm gonna ask Lucas what it is. So we're gonna know. We're gonna know. There's a delay. That's fine. But I want Lucas to tell me what song it is. First chord. Yeah, yeah, he gets to pick. So we're going to play the hits. <clears throat> Those are nice numbers. Boost using persuasion applied to all hero attack and overcome actions until your next turn. He's just playing all star So that's going to be a mid, <laughs> so that's a nine. <laughs> <laughs> so that is a plus three. Something, please. Oh, right, sure. Okay. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll work in conjunction on that one. Plus three, you said? It's a plus three for all hero attack and overcomes. Very nice. But specifically heroes, and none of your minions or anything. Does like Lucas that. have any thoughts about what's on? I asked him who. I have yet to get a response. Yeah, okay. I figured it will, it, will, it will happen when it happens, and right. I'll, I'll, I'll burn my back issue to retcon it in. Excellent. <laughs> it I'll let you do it. You, you pre announced it. Oh, you yeah. have to yeah. burn your back issue. Oh, yeah. It's pre announced. I readied that action. Yeah, you ready the action of <laughs> name the song retroactively once Lucas tells you what Lucas may or may not be. Oh, he's frantically right going through his Spotify <laughs> list right now. <laughs> he's like, oh, I gotta find a good one. Who are you gonna um, pass it to? And so it's you or her, right? I. I no, no, you or her. Oh, thank you. So, yeah. Uh, why don't you put, turn it to the Puce Pigeon, uh, Pigeons? Pigeons, go. Okay, the Puce Pigeons come, and the Puce Pigeons are going to fly at you. Yeah. And they're going to both try to attack you. Bring it on. And they're not hindered. Like the movie? The Eight. Pigeons. Eight damage. <laughs> Maximum possible damage from Puce Maximum Pigeons. Maximum pigeon damage. <laughs> They're just really mad about they the sky blue color that you painted. Oh my gosh! Over there. I, all I did was send I'm sorry about eggplant your eggplant eagle at them. Jeez. But now, she is going to use her painting powers to try to destroy the bubble raft that you're all floating on. Well, only half of us are floating on it now. <laughs> but she's going to get minus five on this. Nice. Glad I hindered her. Oh, oh, oh. So That's... she succeeds with a major twist? No, no. <laughs> She's going to just fail. <laughs> like, well, I, if it's minus five, she has to. <clears throat> right. Because oh, it right, spectacularly it fails. So, and in fact, what she accidentally winds up doing is outside of your current bubble raft, making a larger ring of puce bubbles. Yes. <laughs> that are holding That's it up. That's amazing. I'm way into this. Yep. Yeah. She was distracted by the bear trap on her leg. Yep, that makes sense. And being sky blue. Um, your song is Brighton Rock by Queen. Nice, I'm into that. That's good. That's very good. That's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So she is then going to pass it on to the environment. Oh, no. no secrets. Uh, Bleep. That's Bleep. fine. We never use anything he puts on his Yeah, it's fine. It's just all, it's all <laughs> random crap Adam and I talked about that'll never come up. <laughs> <laughs> it's just games of things. <laughs> Stuff would be useless by now. Right. <laughs> and now the people. This is all a ruse. It's just an elaborate. The puce pigeons. It's white. It's not rouge. So then the environment's going to pass it back to the puce pigeons to start out the next round. Wait, no, no, no. Thanks. Breathe has it Oh, that's true. No, they can't do that. Ha, ha, ha. So I'm you. going to uh, have sca Scavenger Bot and I are going to go and do a little bit of combo attacks. All right. So go, Scavenger Bot. With so those like little chips. snacks. 
Scavengerbot <laughs> and I are, one of us is going to go after the shot. pigeon, and the other one's going to go after her, and we'll figure out which one it is when we get there. Very nice. One time. So, about bacon, egg, and cheese combos. And right, exactly. And they tasted the way you think they would, which is gross. Like pews? <laughs> <laughs> they, they, taste, they tasted the way pews looks. So four, four, and and one. Left, okay. Left them in my fridge for a long time. And so, the guests go, hey, you want some combos? Go, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, I have to attack one target using Scavenger Bot and attack a second target using my Mindai. Cool. Nice. So, I'm going to attack one. I'm going to attack a pigeon for four, and uh, I'm going to attack Paisley Pews for three. This pigeon uh, also for has four, been rather, destroyed yeah. by the scavenger bat. One and plus yeah. ooh, four uh, for galvanizes Pius. three is uh, is four. So fours across the board. All right. And then now you're at the end of the round. Now we're at the end of the round. Not me. I go last. Yeah. So I'm going to pass it to Bubbles. All right, Bubbles. Cool. Um, what you going to do? Right and rock. Like I'm going to use the. I'm going to use a, an, a often unused power. I have telekinesis over bubbles. Oh. Which is different than my bubbles power. Yeah. Um, to bring. <laughs> <laughs> to bring hourly rage back into this battle. <laughs> oh, nice. nice. Oh. Right, because I'm just hungry. You're just, you're just, you're just hanging out right, there, yeah. right? But you're in one, so you can easily get moved around by bubbles. Yeah. Yep. I feel like I definitely can't do any combat in this, but I can. I can boost and hinder. You can do combat in it. It flexes. <laughs> okay. inside of my Not my kind of combat. Yes. yes. Everyone gets a plus one bonus from Sambar, including Jim. Oh, Hi. nice! Sweet. And I totally do some stuff. Um, yeah, so this is an overcome. I don't get to use my max for this. Yeah, I'm just gonna roll it. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, you have you have a plus three. Uh, so, oh, I do have a plus three. That's right. Yeah. So that means that it's a nine. Hey. So you do that. Yeah. That's yeah. right. I just do that. I just bring so you back. You're, out. you're over. It's fine. I float you down on top of the other bubbles, and you're still inside a bubble, but you know you can move around now. So, so do you float him up onto the raft, up next to Paisley Puce, who's flying in the air? Uh, what do you want? Do you want to be? Next to the enemy? Probably next to the enemy. Yeah, I think so. Do that. Do That's where you are. Yeah. You're just floating right next to her. So you can now just like telekinesis the bubble containing your friend Hourly Rage at Paisley Puce. Yeah. yeah. You're like Glinda with a pipe wrench. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> And that is not the first time since this okay? <laughs> I mean, that used to be a well, plumber. There's a story I want to hear during intermission. It's not actually real. <laughs> but it's really funny. It's <laughs> really funny. <laughs> no. It yeah. sounds like the name no, of like, no, someone's I'm... autobiography, Glinda with a paper wrench. Anyway. This I'm is... passing it to you because now you're in position to do something. No, no, no. I still want to go last. Really? Oh, that's right. Yeah, I want to keep going. Okay. Up. I want um, everybody to get a galvanized. Miss what do you got going? Uh... So I went at the end, and yeah. so yeah, now I'm a valid target. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to do another sweep the leg, because I want to keep those hinders on her, oh, yes, in please. case you want to ever uh, beat her down to the pipe I wrench. feel like I want to keep her hindered, actually, at this point. <laughs> All right. Uh, so it was working out for us great. Yeah. I mean, and and yeah, that's true. a lovely d10 for my acrobatics, and a d8 for my status die. Status die. And that is going to be... Plus three. Yep. So, uh, my mid is going to become yeah. a she has five. A negative two. So I've got five, five, four. So my mid is five. Uh, okay. So I attack her for five, and cool. I hinder her for four. Ooh, tell me about this hinder. Uh, I assume that the galvanize, the, the, that that doesn't include all the dice in my pool, I think I have to pick which one it applies to. Yeah, I believe that is yeah. true. Uh, especially for attacks that use mm -hmm. multiple dice. Twice. Yeah. So, uh, that well, is... Apply to all attack and overcome actions. It's so probably I, still I don't think this role. affects your... This is a hinder, so right. regardless, I don't think it works. Right. But it's, it's yeah. still an interesting question to ask. Uh, but if you have an attack, if anyway. you've done that, and then someone rolls an attack that is like, oh, attack... Something mm -hmm. with your max and something with your mid and something with your mid or whatever, right? Yeah. Right. Which which yeah. I, I, I do. Which one so. I right. Yeah. Do that. That's a question. Uh, Dave is in the chat. 
I don't know what Dave says. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, Scavenger Bot is Otherwise going we'll to... Otherwise, we'll think about it later. ...is going to leave, like, a bear trap yeah. of teeth in there. All right. And then, as it retracts, like, shoom, new teeth come in. Cool. Oh, see, I like the idea of How much? going and picking up its old dentures. <laughs> It does it after the battle. It runs around and goes, comp, comp, comp. Gets all the dead There's juice. just these things that continue to Right, he's asking it back. That's right, exactly. feeding a pest dispenser. <laughs> it's like and then it eats it like a... It's something you load a pest dispenser. <laughs> like, pest dispensers feed you, Jody. <laughs> Like a bird. Right. This early technology it's of pest dispenser. Pest dispenser. <laughs> uh, Dave says if it's a generic boost, it applies to only one die. Something like Galvanize works on every die that's an attack or overcome action. Right. So okay. it doesn't affect this one because it's a hinder, but... Well, that's but that's important. good to know. That's yeah. important when... So, yeah, so, when so that is a minus two for, uh, for, scavenger for bear, bear trap bite. Yeah. Cool. Ooh. Scavenger bear. All right, <laughs> and then I'll pass it off to who hasn't gone? I think uh, I know last. Oh, uh, yeah, she's yeah, gone. She, she hasn't gone. No, she hasn't mm -hmm. gone. She hasn't so you gone. gone. I don't think I went. There. I don't oh, think so either. Yeah. Do yeah. we want to pass it off to her now? Yeah, I think, I think so. so. Let's pass it off to her. Okay. So um, basically, Puce, Puce has got. Unless you think you can get rid of those Puce pigeons. It's it's so hard. Unless you think you can get rid of those Puce pigeons. There's only one left. Oh, there's one left. Yeah. I th let's let's see what okay. happens, okay. and then I'll clean up the mess. Yeah, we have to we have to work on that Show thing that you wrote down. You got. Okay, mm -hmm. well this puce pigeon that. is going to come after you again yeah. as mm -hmm. the sky blue painter. Um, Dave clarifies also. So attack with max, attack another with mid, attack a third with min would actually get galvanized on all three, but attack one target with mid max min would only get the bonus once on that total. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. That's good to know. Good. This is why we have damage. I have both of those types. Right, exactly. <laughs> so just one damage from this puce pigeon that flies at you. And Maybe then like Paisley Puce the card turns to the side with her paintbrush and paints an oval looking shape and jumps through it. No. Curse you! No. Should we pursue? Well, uh, yeah. Okay. If we can. That's and also, I need your help. Yeah, all right. Follow her. Follow now she will pass it on to you. What do you do? Um, just go. Just go? Uh, just, I leave well, everyone on my team behind. She can actually pass it to the scene who will pass it to you. There we go. Okay. Um, can we try and figure <laughs> this nonsense world out, maybe? Or just escape it. <laughs> or just escape it. <laughs> maybe it's through that portal. <laughs> Definitely getting a little bit worried about the, the nothingness that surrounds us. Why? Fine. Be because I've seen that movie. <laughs> so we don't want to chase her. I don't. The portal. No, I, I don't know. I think we do. I do. I think we do. I think we do? I think we do. We failed to chase the um, ninja motorcycle. Rocket ninja man. Right. Ninja yeah, motorcycle so man. I, I think we need to make up for our failures. Scene. He's going to get a chase scene in this campaign. Let's give him his chase scene. Also, I, I also recall you've been you. working on something uh, light cycle-ish, perhaps, that we could use have, as transportation. in fact. But can you make three of them? I can. Oh. Do you doubt me? No. I would like Not to Not anymore. Because <laughs> you told me otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I would like to draw three light cycles to chase after Paisley Puce. Okay. And which, which one's that? Oh, you're uh, just doing it. I'm just going to do an action. Yeah, yeah. I don't think. Well, yeah. That's not really an overcome. So, yeah. Um, Describe to me what you're doing here. Well, as we um, pointed out there, while we were on the plane, I was so highly inspired by the last environment that we were in that I was drawing these very, one might say, 80s looking light cycles. Right. Um, so I am going to instead just recreate them in reality so that we can all have a nice light cycle that we can then chase Paisley all right. Puce with. So you wanna, you're here on your giant bubble raft? Mm -hmm. Floating out there is this portal. You yep. want to, before you go through, you want to paint for everyone. Yeah. A light cycle. A yep. mode of transportation. I will let you do that. Yeah. Uh, with a single overcome, as long as you tell me what color each person gets. Sure. I think I know what the four colors are. <laughs> Can't imagine. All right. And you, this is definitely an overcome. He said it. He can't take it back now. <laughs> so it gets a plus three. That's true. Plus whatever other boosts you want to. Yeah. 
throw um, on there. Yeah, and I'm also gonna use my, my plus one from Sanvar, so for okay. plus four, because I feel like we need this. Sanvar, what's your favorite character in uh, Laser Riders? <laughs> <laughs> Um, but six is your mid. Is yep. it, do you use your plus, mid for this? Because it's yeah. just an overcome. No, yep. just a yep. basic yep. action. So six plus four, so ten. So completely So succeed. complete success. What yeah. color are the, are the motorcycles? Um, red. It's vaguely shark shaped. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> um, bubbles, we're going to give you... Um, we'll give you a blue one. Okay. Yeah. And it's then... Uh, we're gonna go with purple, of course. Yeah. It's um, skull shaped. Why isn't it? <laughs> Wait, why don't I have the one in the space suit? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Too late. That's no. fine. Nope. Too late. Um, and she's then, trying to match to our costumes. That's why. Yeah. Because <laughs> um, I know it's changed to it. And then yeah. mine will be yellow. Vaguely horse shaped. Which it's really just add augmentations to my wheelchair, but. Very nice. Those so are you the all have trails we all these need. four. Yeah. Cool little cycles. That's super yeah. cool. Mm -hmm. I, I like it. <laughs> so when you do, when you reference how something is it like, if I would reference like in the letters page, the movie Akira, you wouldn't say the movie Akira though, you would mess up the name. But wouldn't it, would just be Shakira? Sure. But that's a different person. <laughs> this is what I was struggling with just now, trying to say that. Um, I would say Shmakira. Oh, Shmakira. Okay. There we way. go. There we go. Okay. That's, okay, that makes more sense. If I were pressed. Yeah, mm -hmm. if, if, yeah. The Good. traditional Japanese shmanime. Yeah, <laughs> right. Shmakira. Shmakira. There we go. There we go. That's the one. Thank you. I knew we could workshop that. Yeah. <laughs> or we could just say laser writers. You also enunciate it differently, so you could say shmakira or uh -huh. shmakira. So okay. It would sound different. That's good. That's good to know. I need to consult with like Shmeeble. letters page in jokes that I'm not. I don't know how to, how to pull it off. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> So. Clearly, you need to read the shmanga. <laughs> <laughs> it's way better. But you have to read it backwards for reasons. Who do you pass it on to? Um, uh, Matt's the only one left. Yeah. I'm the only one left. I pass it to Matt. All right, excellent. Mm -hmm. I finally have a motorcycle. Yeah. Nice. This is great. What are you going to do? I'm going to pursue. Okay. So you're on a platform, and the, the, the hole that she painted is over there. Yeah, There's the like lights. a gap between you. Yeah, but it's a light cycle. So it's a light okay. cycle. It's made of light. Okay. Can you play bad? It's a sword made of light. Wait, it's a bike made of light. <laughs> are you going to play bad with the bone while you're Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, I have literally nothing that's going to help with this. Motorcycle jumps? You yeah, don't have something yeah, that helps motorcycle think, jumps? Uh, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to vitality these motorcycle jumps with my banter. Okay. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> you must tell arguably us Criminal Underworld. It's not gonna help. No, I got nothing. This is a four. Of I four. will let you do Criminal Underworld. Used to street race. Yeah, that's true. Tell me a story, Matt. <laughs> about why Criminal Underworld will work. I used to street race. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, tell me more. No, like I played your... a bunch of really dingy biker bars. Uh huh. And uh, like was losing the crowd and maybe. Kicked in some of these superpowers a little bit, and uh, definitely got got to ride a few bikes, but like also with the biker, it was fine. That's good. Yeah, it was very good. All right, I was riding on the back. Yeah, it was nice. It was weird because I'm seven feet tall. <laughs> There's a lot of wind resistance. <laughs> yeah, uh, and I'm still in yellow. So yeah, I got nothing. <laughs> Suggestion, trusty, rusty, yeah. strength and vitality. Not gonna do right, this. Yeah, uh, and use trusty, rusty as the handlebars. <laughs> No, I'm not going to do that. Dave that's, says hourly rage equals fast furious. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. It only takes one hour. Oh, good. That's actually not bad. That is, that's a six. That and is, this is uh, an overcome? This is a, yeah, this is a minor twist. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. So you See jump, minor you jump through, boom, through the portal. I'm into it. And, uh. The It's like what, the first twist what was your, What was your uh, mid die on that? Well, oh, that my, was, that was my mid six. was the six. Right, but you take, as you land, you land real hard and take six damage. Sure, that's that completely right reasonable. Yep. Yeah. All right, I know how I'm getting across that gap. Yeah. <clears throat> Dark Kinoto would like to know if you, Paul, remember that you have a plus three bonus from Gen Con. I do, I was just thinking about that the other day. Um, 
I'm gonna think. I, I think I'm gonna use it for the finale. That's kind of what yes. I was thinking. And so that makes sense. How do you yeah. have three from Gen Con? So at Gen Con, uh, there were a lot of tickets, generic tickets, in the live stream that happened. This is a good story oh, for right. the people in the stream. So there's. There was a live game that Christopher ran, and I was just in the chat, mm -hmm. just doing the chat. And people could bring tickets in, up and give them as bonuses to people. Either like <laughs> cheer in the in the Twitch or just bring up physical like Gen Con generic tickets. Well, they did a bunch, and I was given like I Paul, the guy on the chat, was given a plus three. I'm like cool, <laughs> that's neat. But now you're gonna use it. I'm gonna use yeah. it as a GM. As it should. Yeah, that was the thing we talked about at Gen Con. Christopher, like, oh, I'm gonna use that one in my game. Ooh. During next session, you can give some to. Well, Adams is two. Mm -hmm. There's another stream away, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't give them to Christopher. No. Don't ever give But them if anyone gives them to Adam now, you can just use them in Christopher's game when he runs it next. That's true. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> that will just work. And then you'll also have to watch him remind him that he has it. Right. <laughs> because that's the other half of it. <laughs> Trapped. All right. So, who are you going to pass it on to? Who's going who's gonna to make this game? Some weird nether realm of Twitch. I know what I, I want to do. I think it's you. All right. So I'm going to plunk scavenger bot on the handlebars. Yeah. So it's like on a perched uh, up there like, like an E.T. dog hybrid. You know, I got goggles and I'm going to leather jacket. And he's going to cling on and I'm going to use my control over metal to uh, lift scavenger bot just enough to give me a bit of a bunny hop. Is he going to cling on or Romulan? <sighs> Oh, was so good. I broke well, pencil. okay then. <laughs> that killed the momentum. Thank you, Paul. You're welcome. I do what I can. I, <laughs> I know you do. <laughs> what I can is make puns. It's true. And pie. All right. Yeah. I'm good at pie. And my mid is a six. Okay, so you're gonna succeed with a minor twist too, and that's gonna be the same. You're gonna jump through, through that gap with scavenger bot, take six damage as you land, but you're doing all right. All righty. Oh, good. <laughs> Who's going to go next? Uh, you've already gone, right? I made the light cycle. That was this yeah, round, wasn't She has to go last. So, and so I guess it's me. I think it's Jody. I don't have anything that helps write a light cycle either. Jody so just true. makes a bubble around the light <laughs> cycle. That's seriously what I think I'm going to do. That is super reasonable. It's been established that you can do that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So I'm just going to do that thing. Um... I feel like creativity is kind of not how that works at this point. <laughs> um, yeah, alertness. No, your light cycle looks it's... like a surfboard. You make a wave of bubbles. <laughs> nope. No, We're going okay. with alertness <laughs> because of my alertness that I am not equipped to ride a motorcycle. <laughs> I like the idea that of any you, kind. It's, because you're it's the biggest of all the motorcycles. <laughs> yeah. So here we go. The um, there aren't any pedals. The handlebars. This is an over. <laughs> it is an over the using bubbles. The seat. So I get to use my max, which Stays is a nine. Oh well, that's much better than the thing <laughs> oh, that's about to happen. Yeah, I was like, oh no. <laughs> so you just do it. You float over there. Yeah, bubbles. Great. It's fine. <laughs> Although, the, Jody's min was a two. Yeah, oh, that's, mm -hmm. that could have been bad. Yes. <laughs> or awesome. For you. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. the one. That's the one. <laughs> and the people watch. <laughs> Sure. And so now, finally, <laughs> it was on to you. Yeah. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Get, sorry, I felt like there should have been something in between that. Yeah, I know. Like, to, okay. They went. Okay. I've got to do this. She went. You don't see her, though, so okay. I'm not going to tell you what she did. Why not? Because You don't know? All right. Um, also, for all intents and purposes, we just blipped out of existence, and we don't know where we landed either. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Which is great. Maybe we didn't land anywhere. Oh, no. Like I can. actually have to use a D6. You hit something. That's true. You could have hit that. That's also true. You could hit our What did I hit? That's a 6. <laughs> Basically, Basically use. <laughs> Wait, it's a 7. Do you have a minus? No. A 7 is your mid. Oh, yep, you're right. So you just succeed. Yeah. So you, I, only one I that can ride painted a single. ramp and I went <laughs> and then made the jump great. through so the portal. So you all successfully get through yep. and you are. No, uh, seven yeah. is, is with a minor twist. Minor twist. Is seven is a minor twist? Yep. Yeah. Okay, so you take, you take seven damage then when you land. No. Um, happy little trees. Uh, after dice pool is rolled, adjust one die up or down one value. So I would like to Aha! seven eight. You, nice. you land with no damage. And you come through and you land, and you are all on your bike. Cheat sheet. On an ice sheet in the snow. It is ridiculously Ugh. cold. It is like 50 below zero. And also very white. Yeah. So it looks a little bit different. There's now stuff. You're not in a normal, like, room temperature nothingness. You are now on an ice sheet in a blizzard. 
and you can see up ahead through the through the snow, the blowing snow. It's not gonna be a blizzard. It's just like really windy. It's ridiculously cold. Like uh, it is between 40 and 50 below. Like it's really really cold. Yeah. And uh, you see a puce path percolating. Does she bleed? Through the Could you draw us some coats? <laughs> proceeding to no. <laughs> There's Whatever. Anyway, you can see it, and it goes off ahead to the snow. But it is kind of dark. There's not a lot of uh, light in the sky, and there's like a. It's kind of the sky is kind of grayish. It's like twilighty right now. So there's like okay. so a there's werewolf, sparkly. a vampire. Yeah. yeah. Right. They sparkle. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so in any any other right? You also <laughs> notice a few things that happen. The first thing you notice is that it seems to be. A new scene. Mm. Oh. You get a new scene tracker. Very interesting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh no. Does anyone have heals? I feel like uh, other characters? I can heal me and only me. <laughs> I know you're talking about the shoes, and I was like, that's gonna be terrible in the snow. <laughs> <laughs> you want bigger shoes. Does anyone have heels? Did we get the, the parkas from the plane before the plane proceeded to? Disappear. I don't believe so. There was no reason why we would. Right. So the other thing you're going to have, I was going to say, is that it is very cold, right? So there is going to be a persistent environmental effect Mm -hmm. um, where you are going to be damaged by the environment every turn. Ah, so it's like me every day in the office. Yeah. (laughs) I need some minions to Damaged by the cold. (laughs) This is actual cold, though. Right. Here's the psychological. Nope. Then it's like, it's 68 degrees, die. Yeah, the appropriate temperature <laughs> right. for an office. That's how you stay alert. <laughs> I. So now we are back at the top. We're, we're back to starting out. So who wants to kick off this first round in this thing? So you can see the path. You can see that it's super ridiculous cold out here. Um, if you want to do something about that, let me know. I feel like the concept artist should go first. Can I make a parkas? She was the no, tar- no, this is now the we're starting off a new one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. a new scene. <gasps> Coming into this new I scene. I would like so. to paint some parkas into existence. I think. Yeah. Do you want me to fail first so you can use your principle of great power? I can't make parkas. I, I can't help but fail. <laughs> I can wrap us in metal. It's not a good idea, but I can do that. <laughs> not a great insulin. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make a bunch of bubbles. <laughs> more and you more. You make bubbles. things explode real slow. It's, it's like fire, fire <laughs> and fire is hot. <laughs> No, I think that's okay. Mishap can lightning Fire us. Fire hot. <laughs> what? Mishap can lightning us. It's that's true. also hot. Yeah. It's just for not very warm. long. Uh-huh. We can just bring back the lightning rod and it'll be fine. <laughs> I don't have a lightning rod. How? Can I tell you about the lightning rod? How could you forget? <laughs> we didn't tell Adam about the lightning rod. That's right. I got strapped. A, a decorative lightning rod strapped to my back. Decorative mm-hmm. because it was plus zero. Right. <laughs> but... It looked cool. Yeah. No, I, 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 I kept the card. It cool. <laughs> I thought it looked cool. It, it looked. <laughs> Want to write kind of raccoon tail onto the top of it? <laughs> uh, it's a four. Sure is. That's not great. That's fine. Minor twist. This, this might be worth burning. Action succeeds with a minor twist. This might be worth burning. It's a, only a minor twist. I, I You know what? I okay. don't know even why I'm afraid of this. I. For That's some right. reason, I'm trying to fight against my instinct. Right. But it makes all so of the you, other clothes disappear. So you successfully paint a bunch of carcass for everyone. Um, like you're going to need... A twist. You're going to need... That's good. So this is like a two-overcome uh, environmental issue, Okay. basically. So you succeeded in one of them. So now you've got people with like, some very warm parkas on. They're going to need a little bit more stuff, but you've gotten them closer to that, which is great. That's great. Um, the minor twist that you're going to get is everyone is going to get a minus one hinder as they get used to wearing this big bulky coat while driving a motorcycle. Oh yeah, that's fair. Yeah. So, that's what's going to happen there. No one gets gloves. What about gloves? Uh, who wants to go next? Um, what's a good one? song that'll make you feel warm inside. All right. Um, no, no, no. Uh, I would like to go. Okay. Close. I'm excited. <laughs> but I don't want to tempt fate. Uh, suggestion. Persuasion. I'm in yellow. 
Still? Yeah, I'm still in yellow. Uh, I'm gonna play Cheeseburger in Paradise. <laughs> 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 and, uh... <clears throat> yeah, that's the one. <laughs> yep, that's, yes, that song. Uh, in the hopes of, ooh, a six. That's a plus two boost for all of your overcome actions that I'm assuming you're all gonna have to make now because I don't have anything to help help you do it other than just help you be better. So my question I have for all of you is, are you, are you also driving forward while you do this? So we're gonna do, are you, are you, trying to, are you actually trying to chase her? I, I think we, I'm I going think, to. I think we yep. have. Okay, sure. cool. So then here's how that's gonna work as you're kind of doing that. So you can each do, and I'm sorry I didn't say this at the beginning, you, you can each do an action and then also proceed to drive your motorcycle forward following kind of the path that looks mm -hmm. like she's going on. Yeah. Um, if we wanna close. If you wanna her. close with her, you need to take your action to move again, basically. Sure, sure that makes right. sense. Right. And once you get close to her, you'll be able to see where she is. Right now we're like keeping pace with her. Yeah. Gotcha. That but right, sense. depending on what she's doing. But you don't know until you can see her. Mm -hmm. Right. So I assume you're all just moving yeah. but doing another action. Mm -hmm. yep. Cool. Who Who's going wants it next? I'm just going to try to close with her. Do it. All right. So, so yeah, I'm just whole turn trying to catch. Okay, cool. So you both are doing that. Yes. Yeah. Great, right. But we should I mean, If you want to do it one at a time, that. that's yeah. fine. It's, it's... Do you want to do it first? You, you do it first. Okay. I double move to try and close in with her. Okay. Hopefully I don't die. So you, you both do that, and that is good. So you're, you're now ahead. And you, you move a lot farther ahead, and what you see ahead of you is that the kind of puce path that you're following splits two different directions. Oh, yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Split the party. So there's a few different ways that you can solve that. There's a few different approaches you could take. Particularly right or left. Yeah. And then I guess that's my turn because it's the one's yeah. left. Yeah, so that's what you both oh, do. the environmental. Yeah, so now we're going to go over to the environment and her and stuff like that. So that's what happens. We're now in the yellow zone, if you weren't already. I assume that you are going to like let us know this through our Yeah, no, it's like the, the, yeah. the path. Yeah. The path yeah. So you both see that. So you both don't. You're oh, together. I was, I was going to let her go before I went. Oh, okay, perfect. Never mind that. The pathway is split. Please join me so that we can solve this. Yeah. So is that what you do? Please join me so we can split the party. Do, what do you do now? Okay. It's your turn. Um, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Uh, yep. Cool. So you are there at the same point, and you're a little bit behind them. All right. So who are you going to pass it to next? Oh. Um, no, not me. <laughs> okay. Um, Let somebody get this, artist. this galvanized. Yeah. So remind me again, because it's so cold. We take... Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. Everyone is going to take the environment's damage. Okay. Yeah. So everyone is going to take two damage from the coldness. Oh. This, is, this is not good. Or bad. Can I still see them? Yes. You're right behind them. But you can see them. You can see everyone within one range thing of you. So if you get within one range thing of her, you'll totally be able to see her. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna, I need to do one more overcome to deal with the cold environment, yes? Yeah. All right. That's and I have party. a plus two yes. from, I believe it was, oh, from you. Yeah. Okay. Two for the cards. Two, right. I think that there's no longer any way of, of stopping it. I'm so excited about this. We're <laughs> <laughs> we gonna have a party split situation? So yeah. Net plus one. <gasps> My favorite thing. Yep. And it's a mid, so that makes it a seven. Yeah. And you can adjust it up or down one. Yeah, do it, do it, we're going to happy little trees that again. Yes. So that it's <laughs> Good, wise. Yep. All right, so you just succeed. So now the environmental effect is, is I'm gone. I'm afraid of minor twists, but I love seeing that work. Mm -hmm. Like, I love seeing yeah. those little tiny incremental things yeah. happen. So, well, specifically, the two of you, it's gone for. The two of them, you have the things to give them as soon as you're in the same spot. Okay, that's fair. You see what I'm saying? That's fine. Yeah. We have the lowest hit points. The totally sweet gloves. Yeah. yeah. You will get. Sure. Well, I was going to make seems... tiny little personal size space heaters for everybody. Oh, or that's... I thought I was going to have mittens that were like throughout my space suit. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't lose them. <laughs> no, I figure we all just have a floating space heater next to us. 
goes with us every Is it like a little go. sun? Yeah, it's a tiny little sun. <laughs> yeah, I have created space. four new suns. <laughs> what could possibly five, go wrong? <laughs> five extra suns. <laughs> <laughs> we wonder why the crown is melting. Anyway, uh, who wants to go next? Like solve global warming. I mean, like, do we want to just let them split up? I don't know what to do about this. <laughs> Like, I, I, I don't, don't think we can until we get, until we, at least I don't think it's a good idea to split up until we get the warm gear that will keep us from dying. I'm okay with that. I will grab the warm I'm gear not. from her. I'm not. All right. Okay. You I'm do what you want. It's not going to be my whole I'm going to wait. Right? Yeah, yeah, no, no. Mm -hmm. You can grab the whole, so gear from her take. just I'm for free. i the gear and then I'm going to catch up with them and throw this like throw a dagger. Oh, nice. Okay. Great. So you, you want to like fling out the, <laughs> fling the gear out that has been made. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, they're suns. Make, that, that, is, that, is, that is official. No, now. that's all right. I'll let you do that. That's all right. I, I believe you I'm can do that. I'm going to steer with my knees. I believe you can steer do it. Steer this motorcycle with my knees. If that's going to be your whole turn, I, I buy it. Oh, all right. Yeah. And now we've eaten our cheeseburgers and they're gone. Great. <laughs> so there We're you go. We're in paradise. We're in Antarctica. Uh, so now, now you have the warm gear. So this is, is really and truly gone. Well, cool. Oh, that's not the split path. Oh, the split path. The environment. Just yeah. <laughs> so the yeah, 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 the split path is gone. We are no longer we are no longer Four boosted. Happy though. little sons. Mm -hmm. Correct. Everywhere. You are no longer boosted. Forever comes. But you are also not just taking one mm -hmm. detail. Yeah, no, I, I agree that that is the ideal better. Situation. Definitely. Just better. Definitely better. I'm what happened taking to being requests, a hero? Though. <laughs> Part of being a hero is not dying stupidly to the cold. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Chapter thirteen. <laughs> That's in one of the sticky notes. <laughs> Very important. If chat has any requests, I will play them and figure out a way to work them into the game. Nice. But I also have to recognize the song, so keep it classic rock, please. <laughs> or 90s. Um, bubbles. Cool. I'm going down the left path. All right. Because <laughs> uh, I knew this was going to happen. <laughs> So, yeah. all right. So you zoomed on the left song, path. What else are you doing this turn? Uh, that's it. I'm just, Full speed. I'm trying to catch. Yeah. Okay. We were walking. So the you zoom down this path, yeah, and you totally walking. catch up walking with. Next to a bunch. We might as well be walking on the suns. Rocket. <laughs> you catch up with four <laughs> rocket <laughs> troops, <laughs> like from the beginning oh, of the issue. Oh, the rocket oh, guys. The rocket troops are bad. I need two d6s. I'm very I like to think that this. Basley Puce is the person behind this all. Probably not. We have one more session. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that's what you I find. I don't game, but I'm pretty sure not. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's so exciting. Mm -hmm. Cool. And then I'm going to pass it to... Uh, I'm going to pass... This is, like, I feel bad. I should have been asking chat what I feel like I've passed you. Since the beginning. Okay. Wait, I can't, wait, I can't wait, pass it wait. to people I can't see, right? Oh, you could. Um, but... Have we gone through a whole scene? Can you pass it back to me? Because uh, I am the only one not caught up with the group yet. Uh, the start of the scene, I believe, actually was you. That was the start was of the you, scene. Yeah. So when you, you, you. So yeah, you can either pass okay. it to all the bad guys or pass it on to gotcha. me. What do you think? Do you want to go or do you want all the bad guys to go? I mean, if I can catch, I, I can catch up to you pretty easily, and then I can start, and then I can take I an action. Going which the other will... way. <sighs> If you want to be left to their tender mercies, then I am fine with that. You're on a motorcycle. You don't have to make that yeah. literally. I could do that. Okay. I'm not okay with that. Yeah, so where you also, are, the, the path sort of that. ends, and then there's rocket the, troops. The path ends, and there's rocket yeah. troops. Uh, she's not this way. <sighs> right. Do we just ignore the rocket troops? No, no, we don't. I'm not abandoning a teammate. Do you know the rocket troops are there? Are you sure there are rocket troops? Do you... The, do, I, I does don't... Mishap no. Do you, have you that told That is the question. Has Bubbles told Mishap like, or not? Now that I know that the path ends, no, absolutely not. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Bubbles! <laughs> <laughs> so you go to the right. Yeah. Okay. I tell everybody, Bubbles checked out the left path. It's completely clear. It's 100% safe and there's zero... So are you just... Are you, are you moving twice? Like double moving? Uh, down the right path? You know, yes, I am. Okay, so right you no, okay. <laughs> see Paisley Puce. Paisley Puce is like riding, like surfboard riding a wave of Paisley Puce paint that she's like painting out in front of her with a paintbrush. Swoom, down the path, and that is what is making the, the thing. <laughs> and so you you come up and you are like real quite close to her. So that is, it takes your whole turn, but you're right there, right. Yes. I think that's the end of the order, except for that, right? 
So yes, now we, we see where chaos rocket rocket So now this what's going to so what's going to happen is that uh, maybe two I of feel them. Like I'm going to know once the rockets start going off. That mm -hmm. You right. might. I'm at the split. I only got to the split. Two of them yeah. are going to shoot some darts at you. Okay. That's very quiet. And those darts. Not going to succeed. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they're, they're trying to do a thing to you. Yeah, no, not. that's great. And then the other two, they're going to choose to let them fail, though, because they rolled poorly. Sure. <laughs> and then the other two are going to deal you six damage. All right. By All right. shooting you with their guns. I mean, so they have dart guns and gun guns. I'm in the red zone. Guns. Love right. It. right. And so they're there. You kind of like cruise up to them on your bike and be like, oh, it ends. And then rocket troops are like, bah, 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 and shooting you. Yeah. So that's what they do. Cool. Then, um, the environment is going to go. Then Paisley Pew's here is going to first paint a big, elaborate uh, uh, po uh, polar bear, even though you're at the South Pole. This is a Pew's polar bear, which doesn't belong here at all. She doesn't know anything about what animals belong at the South Pole. Clearly, <laughs> she paints a Pew's polar bear, and it is going to be... You do that, I'll do that. <laughs> oh my god. Just a lot of songs for that. Oh, that's story. actually. Why did I do she this? Does, <laughs> yeah, but she doesn't need to do that. But she, she just makes the Puce Polar Bear. So the Puce Polar Bear is there and is um, <coughs> in your. In, in, like, in the way of the path that is behind you. So anyone that comes behind you could get attacked by the Puce polar bear, but you're totally fine. You can just keep going. Okay. And then uh, Paisley Puce is going to move off a little ways ahead, but this you can see what so she is. Exciting. I, I inform the rest of my team that there is a Puce polar bear in the way that they'll probably have to deal with. All right. Cool. Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Not the wrong path. <laughs> cool. So then you see uh, Paisley Puce is going to pass things back to the rocket troops. And the rocket troops are now going to run over to you. Mm -hmm. And they are all going to try to destroy your motorcycle. Okay. So that you can't go at that. So what they're going to do specifically, they're going to put, they're going to try to damage. They're going to put hinders on it. Sure, that makes sense. They're going to hinder, hinder you and your motorcycle with their like snow cabling stuff like that. All right, and they're going to hinder you a bunch. Oh yeah, they sure are. A two, a two, a three, and a one. So you just you just covered in all of these like uh, like cords and stuff that are trying to tie you down and like make it so you can't escape. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So that's what they do, and then finally Paisley Puce is going to zoom even farther ahead, so she's hard to see. She's now just just beyond your sight range, <sighs> and then right. she's going to pass it over to you. All right. Uh, I'm going to continue in my pursuit of Paisley Puce. Okay. Yes. Uh, Heroic. I <laughs> really like to be able to attack her. Okay. So I can get close to her. Yeah, you can get close to her with your whole action now, but you won't be able to attack her on this turn. But if you go before she goes again, then you totally will. I think I have to. Like, right. I, I, she went at the beginning of the round, so yeah, right, you're going right. to get another one. Yeah. Yeah, if and you time I, it right. Everybody know that I'm keeping pace with her. Mm -hmm. Cool. Uh, who wants it? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, by all means. I want to catch up to everyone else. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me more. What are you going to do? Uh, like, it. does he have a car? Um, exactly. Yeah. I think that's it. I think I'm just going to do double what movement if, to catch up. Wait, where are you? Edit, I'm at the split still. You're at the split. I'm at the split. And then one move to the left is rocket troops. One mm -hmm. move to the right is a... Sol <laughs> is a, is a Paisley, Paisley polar, polar bear thing, yeah. As opposed well, to a solar bear, which is something that she you've seen. Thing. You've seen the way she portaled out of the nothingness world into here. You might be able to portal yourself in front of her. I mean, you've seen it done. Yeah, you're seen the only anything she done. does, you can do better. That yeah, or right. just or just the paint a giant the rocket on the back of your motorcycle and go. Yep. Oh, that I could do. <laughs> I will 100% let you try to portal as well. Now you're thinking well, of portals. 
technically speaking, I can't do that because I can only paint into existence what I know, and I don't know what the environment in front of her looks like, so I right. can't pour you can paint. So here, this is what this is. I, this yeah, is, you know this what is how it like. works. You mm -hmm. know how to make a portal like Paisley Puce did. Yes. You've done right? it before. It's really hard. I've done it. You can try to do it with an overcome, but every single twist is major. There's no minor twist, it just major twist. I mean, come on. Yeah, all you, right. You've got your uh, collected trade. Yeah, all right. Let's do it. it. You can max it out. Because you're trying to go somewhere that is described to you by mishap. Over the radio. Why? Based on a thing that you based it's white and somewhat featureless. Based on a thing that you saw someone do once from a distance. Well, in all fairness, though, using my collector trade, uh, I did make a portal previously to put oh. snakes on a plane. So. Oh, that's true. This I got this. That's it's true. Fine. What could go wrong? The numbers, mostly. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you've seen it done by someone younger than you, so, so maybe you could use the principle of great power. I assume Paisley Peace is younger. Is Paisley Peace younger than Maybe me? she was a Hold former on. student. Hold on, what? Are, what are, it's a one, two, and a nine. If you make your two, the, um, oh, no, no, no make, make the, the oh, one, one a ten. A, yeah, yeah. Because which then, then makes, makes the it a nine, nine the mid. Yeah. Nine's yes. a mid. Yes, yep. correct. Okay. So I max out the ten <laughs> using a nine, <laughs> so <laughs> it succeeds. So you nice. so you succeeded. Okay, Where's good. Uh, you're about to get two major twists. So, oh, the, I'm kind of sad about that. Yeah, no, that's Sorry. really great. <laughs> no, that's really fun. So you pop out of the portal right there, that's and you see mishap one there and Paisley Fuse, mm -hmm. and others you as well. <laughs> I was like, oh, we have to work together on that one. I assume that's my turn. Yeah, that's your turn. Yeah, okay. Very cool. Who you passing oh. to? Bubbles, you want to play with rockets? Yes, of course right. I do. Um, you, you've been shot and covered in ropes. Yeah, I sure have. I'm going to use my burst your bubble ability. Okay. Um, I attack multiple targets using bubbles, and I use a mid die against each target, Ooh. and take damage equal to my max die. But when I'm in red zone, which I am now, bubbles heal me. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's very fortunate. So, um, <clears throat> definitely I've created an enormous bubble. It's yeah. going to be floating toward them. Um... It is, this is the biggest bubble I've ever made, and like, you can see the scenery reflected in it just a little bit, and like, weirdly flashing by, you see Sanbar and Lucas <laughs> both reflecting out of this bubble. <laughs> and uh, get a d12 because I'm in red. So, okay, three, five, and six. Um, <laughs> so, how, okay, how does adding my, my pluses to it go? Uh, so, and you've got to add minuses it, as well. It actually doesn't matter, because I have a, mi a minus, right? Yeah. You have a minus one. I have a minus one and minus two, or two minus twos. Minus one. Oh, minus minus right. three and a minus one. Minuses. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> covered in ropes. Yep, yeah. covered in ropes. Um, so, does one, only one of those apply, or what? Yes, only one of them apply, because then you, you apply them sequentially, and from this to Dave, I believe like every roll that you do, they apply sequentially down the roll, okay, right? Okay, sure. So, but now, are, are you count use, you're but using multiple of those dice, right? Yes. So each of those dice gets one. Okay. And you select which ones go where. Okay. So um, I'm just going to leave these essentially where they are. My pluses are going to balance out with one of the negatives. Okay. And um, that'll be a negative two. And then I'll use the other negative two also. So these bubbles are blowing up the ropes that are on you as well. Yes, <laughs> yes. exactly. <laughs> Right. Um, and so um, I will do five damage to all of them. Oh, okay. Two of them just get yeah. flattened and knocked out totally because of the bubbles. And two, the other two are going to... And then I'm going to heal for four. Nice. I want that ability. I know, right? <laughs> I accidentally made like a min max character <laughs> because I had one thing that I was like, oh, I really want to do this thing. Um, and then that's everyone's turn, right? Nope. No. no. Who's, I who's left? You haven't gone yet. Okay, okay. go. Hourly Rage. Can do I your see thing. this polar bear? I, up ahead of you? Yeah, you can move and then get to the polar bear. Can I move and get to the polar bear and take an action? Yes. Wonderful. Describe to me how big this polar bear is in terms of dice. Oh, okay. 
Great, so this polar bear is, in terms of dice, so it's not really a minion. So this polar bear oh, well, then is never mind. a... Oh, <laughs> Then never mind, well, don't worry about it. Okay. Yeah, it's like an environmental hazard that's in your way that's like slowing oh, you down and stopping you from doing stuff. Definitely not a minion, though. I see. <laughs> <laughs> if this were a minion... If this were a minion, what dice would it re would represent it? So, Think about how much you want to see Hourly Rage riding into battle on a Puce Polar Bear. Also, <laughs> also, for me to do this, I have to take a minor twist. Yeah. So you're getting that out of it. Yeah, it would be a D8. Be a D8. Yeah. What if it was my D8? All right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Tell me about my minor twist. All right, great. Great, 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 great. So the minor twist is that you can put the powers together and grab this polar bear and do it. But as you do that, um, getting on the polar bear, you're now interacting with and taking over all of the, a bunch of like Paisley Puce power, right? Okay. So all of your concept artist stuff disappears and vanishes. Okay. So your light cycle and your coat and your space heater are all gone. But I'm still writing a bear. That is true. Into it. Good, okay. <laughs> New album cover. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, uh, you can wear it, wear very, it very importantly, <laughs> while riding the bear, because we're friends now, uh, I'm, so I start playing two tickets to paradise. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure it's not two tickets to paradise? <laughs> also good. All right, good, just checking. <laughs> um, and that's my turn. <laughs> yeah. And it was worth it. Uh, they've gone. Yeah. So I have to pass to the uh, scene. We have to add. No, no, the scene's no, no, all gone. Oh, scene's gone. gone. Yeah. You, you can pass to an ally, which you probably want to do. Okay. Yeah. So, when I was putting Scavenger Bot back together, I yeah. made a few changes so that it would be easier to put him back together in the future. Uh, which is why I'm going to take a minor twist Lay and down. blow him up. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, I can put him back together. This is part of life. He knows it. It's, 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 it's the glorious Just circle of life. Bear traps everywhere. <laughs> I made mean, a character in an RPG. So, hand grenade and bear traps. Was exploding. Uh, oh, what am I going to be doing? Bear. Bear. No bear traps. Is Don't throwing her a major or minor twist, throwing, please. Throwing scavenger bot right at Paisley Puce while riding this motorcycle. What's that? You killed me with that character. Did I really? Yes. I forgot. <laughs> 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 Apparently, I killed Adam with my character that's main superpower was exploding. <laughs> I destroy but, all of my bonuses, adding <laughs> them each to this attack first, even if they are exclusive. Oh, oh. goes. So, so uh, was it? Yep. <laughs> one one of the pieces of wreckage that I used uh -huh. to rebuild uh, to rebuild Scavenger Bot was from Lucas Aerospace and another Very one nice. from Sonbar <laughs> Systems. Uh, I'm good. also going to be using my hero point rewards of two and my hero point rewards of three because I can do that even if they're exclusive. Very cool. So I may have a bulky have coat, a but I've got an exploding bot that's going yeah. right at her face. Those numbers. You rolled a zero. Come what? on. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait, that's good. 15, 16, 17, uh, 20, 22, plus one, minus one. So 22 at her. Holy crap. And uh, I can no longer use Scavenger Bot this scene. Yes. So your what was your min die? One. OK. Well, you have a persistent minus one hinder as long as you don't have Scavenger Bot. OK. But I now have a cloud of scavenger bot bits that I've used right. my metal powers. You to sort also of have destroyed Paisley Puce's uh, power stripe that's behind her and just flattened her out, knocked her out on, into the snow. Now she's just skidding and also making yeah. a Paisley trap. <laughs> right. <laughs> Would you say that she's very cold? Yes. Start playing Ice Ice Baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on this list. It's not on so this with list. that, I got all lists. Going with that, off. this the chase is done, and you see, and you can see kind of up ahead in the distance <laughs> in the twilight, <laughs> sparkling vampires, a mountain that is also, up there that she, looks like she was bear. heading toward because you see a little some lights on it. I let uh, the mountain. rest of my team know because everybody's out of danger and mm -hmm. uh, everything's clear. All right, uh, as far as I know. Not, not quite out of danger yet. So you take one damage from the cold. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. No, it's basically. Yeah. 
But I also don't have a persistent minus one because I right. don't have a bulky coat on either. That is true. And they, they weren't persistent. They were just a one-time use minus one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fine. I never rolled. That's all right. <laughs> I kept doing other stuff. I, I reshape bits of, of metal to tie Paisley Pews over the back of the motorcycle. Very good. What are you going to do? Um, I'm going to... Um... Oh, no. <laughs> what? You knocked out her power stripe. Does the bear just... Disappear out from underneath me. <laughs> no, you're oh, taking over the bear. That's good. It's your bear now. It's my bear now. Mm -hmm. um, it will last for the rest of the scene. I'm, I'm going to burst burst your bubble again mm -hmm. um, the on case, these two the rockets. Case polar bear. Mm -hmm. And so I get bubbles and I get um, alertness because I'm, it's an important battle skill. And then I have my status die, which is again yellow, which is kind of unfortunate. But whatever, I'll fix that in a second. Mm -hmm. And um, those are, that was not the D10 I thought it was. Um, okay, so it is six, seven, and eight. So they get, um, I'm gonna put the minus one on the seven and the minus three on the eight. Okay. <laughs> which means that they will get a, they'll take six damage each. Oh, so they just die? They just die. They're gone. You got them. And I will take um, five damage. Yeah. They get a last stand, though. This, yes, but they can't roll a five. Oh. Right. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sorry. No, no. They do get a last stand, totally. <laughs> but likewise, what you get? Like, they're D4s. <laughs> There's right. nothing, nothing can be done. So, yep. Yep. <laughs> they have no boosts. All right. So now, now all the bad guys are gone. The thing you said before is true now. Okay. Right. Well, there's one more. There are mine now. Yeah. So now you make your way. To, what are you going to do? Rocket, together? There are rocket troops. I catch up to the group. Remember rocket troops? Yeah, we, no. all, we all catch up. Troops. I'd like to know where she's going, where she was going. I think that was toward that mountain. Turns out. Anyone going to do anything for Harley Rage? Yeah, I'm just going to keep taking damage. By the way. I'm, at, I'm at nine, so there's nothing I can do for Can we radio Matthew's No, no, no. Name? Riley Rage no longer has a coat or a space heater. Yeah, I lost right. my coat and my space oh, heater. Oh, right. Do you want another little fun? <laughs> no. I want the other thing. Fine. <laughs> you want a solar parka. Look, beggars no, can't be choosers. I want a solar bear. You give them whatever you want. <laughs> I want my bear to be I warm know, enough. I wanted to make a solar bear. Fine. You wanted to make a solar bear later. I wanted to make a solar bear against the rockets, and then she killed them all. No, none of our plans worked out. Hey, we got Ice Ice Baby in there. That's true. Can we radio Matthew Spain <laughs> to get some supplies that aren't definitely delusions? Yes, that's fair. Definitely, you can. And maybe some medical attention. That also sounds great. And maybe to get someone who can take Paisley Puce and put her in actual custody, as opposed to the back of a motorcycle <laughs> freezing. I don't see why that was an issue. I'm gonna bring one of the rocket troops with me just to show everyone. Who All right. This one? Okay. So, so like now they're like Will Smith in, uh, in it, right in Independence Day. This, this if you're walking through the desert, but as Joe said, <laughs> with the alien. The dragging the oh no! <laughs> you're you're in definitely in flying. Yes. Yeah. Whoa! I'm sorry. What did we name like, this? Remotely competent. Because <laughs> we're in a very remote, remote locale, and also <laughs> okay. we're barely competent. <laughs> So you you ra so it's very cold here. You make you make some stuff. But you radio Matthew Spain, mm -hmm. and he says, uh, "Proceed. He'll, they'll meet you at the. It looks like from your location, you've you found it's actually a super villain. It's Matthew S. Payne. An actual right. <laughs> you found it. You found a, a, a actually that'd be kind place of, cool of interest. If the others were his like lieutenants, <laughs> and we had to fight yep. on English. So you you tell him your coordinates and the coordinates yeah. where you're going. So yeah. he said, it looks like you're approaching uh, Mount Erebus." And you're going to, and there have been some weird signals coming from there. So they will meet you there, basically. Okay. Nice. Up at the Canada, the summit, where they can fly in easily with helicopters. While I am on the way there, I'm reworking Scavenger Bot into a new, a new, a uh, new type of Scavenger Bot. That yeah, you'll need to find like an enclosed or indoor different. space in order to do that. Mm -hmm. But then but you can bring all the stuff with you. Yep. I'm hoping I can get some light cycle parts on there, even if they're only just real enough. Yeah. If only. <laughs> We had someone who could make an enclosed or indoor space. If only. That was warm with like yeah. cushy chairs. We do, the UM. <laughs> oh, yeah, them. They <laughs> perfect <laughs> fireplaces, it turns out. Yeah, let's, the UN. let's do that. Make like a heated tent that moves with us. Sure. Yeah, that's all right. You're not fighting people? I'll let you yeah. do it. So you're gonna you're gonna keep still moving toward the mountain? Yeah, so we can okay. still move, but it, it's like in heated and enclosed and 
It's just a moving tent yeah, because Arby's? for some reason that <laughs> seemed more logical Disgusting. to me than an RV. I'm not <laughs> sure why. Yeah. So. Cool. That's cool. a four. That's what well, RVs are. They're moving yeah, tents for minor landing. twist. Okay, that's good. That's good. You're moving along just fine. It's great. Tent is a lot smaller than I thought it would be. As you, I guess that's right. This is good. All right. That's so, how it's warm. And as you get close to, you see the you see the mountain up ahead. And uh, it looks like a real big mountain, but there's definitely some stuff over the top of the mountain. Oh, uh, you can see there's, there's someone in there, oh, and they're boy. doing some stuff. But you're way down lower than this, kind of at the foothills at the mm -hmm. base. And it, there's various caves and rocks and other stuff kind of up there. And you can see off in the distance over there, there's kind of a path that's been carved up into the mountain, slowly going up the mountain. Mm -hmm. And there seem to be rocket troops over there. Oh, ho, ho. Mm-hmm. Well, let's meet up at the UN and then, uh, and then go up oh, the yeah, mountain. Oh yeah, that. I was like, let's go get It, it would just be a good truth. idea to just like heal yeah, a yeah. little bit. And yeah. I can recover. heal a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, for the rest Heels of us. Would be good. Oh, I'm two points away from red. It's fine. I yeah. would. It's, I would stop. like to heal. Yeah. So let's, Matthew let's, Spain, do, do you tell Matthew it's, Spain where you are specifically? Yeah. All right. So Matthew Spain sends you down. He's like, okay, here's what we can do. We'll, we'll we don't want to alert them, right? So we'll drop you some supplies. Yeah. Down here, right? So let you heal up quite a quite a bit. It'll let you let you let you get better. Snacks. Basically, drop you enough chicken enough snoops. supplies to kind of chicken snoops. Heal Those all the way spies. up. Chili. Repair your stuff. You can sit in here and repair your bot. Anything you want to request in order to repair scavenger bot as well can be sent to you here. But then they're gonna plan a two pronged attack here on this base with you. And so they want you to heal up. Let them know. Give them the signal when they're ready to go. And then they will move in. Then, then they'll have you move in and like infiltrate from down below, while um, they come in and fly in <clears throat> to the top. So I absolutely to request any bear traps they yeah. have. Oh, absolutely. They send you. They send you like a crate. You know, like the this end up kind of packaging <laughs> with the stuff like yeah. this, those wood with the slats and stuff like that, full of bear crates. And there's like the sh wood shavings in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for yeah. packing material. Yeah. There's also a lamp in there and shoots like a woman's leg. Yeah. It's a whole thing. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. I didn't know this was going to be a Christmas episode. <laughs> <laughs> How far do we heal? There's snow. All the way up. Oh, we're yeah. crazy. Wow. All the way up. All you got enough up. stuff. You can that's heal scary. the way up and be working down that's, here. That's really scary. Absolutely so. And I assume they provide us with some sort of gear that we can wear that doesn't snacks. provide a hinder. Yeah. Okay. And snacks. It's exactly like everything our, like that. It's exactly like our old uniforms and costumes, but blue and white with a fur collar. Every one of them. That's how action figures in the 90s worked. <laughs> <laughs> and so with that, we're going to end this first, this fifth issue here. Yeah. That's where we're going to be. Okay. It's a good place Remotely to be. Remotely confident. Yeah. <laughs> we only got one hero point this issue. Yeah, that's bad. It's all right. It's not good. You only changed what I was going to do a little bit. Oh, I didn't that's use awesome. My... I think no, that's good, really the point. Art. That's the problem. That, that's that's the point of everything. We did. Biggest yes. disappointment right there. So let's do. Here's what I want to do now. I want to talk to the chat. That's terrible. Ask yeah, some absolutely. questions and talk a little bit. Then we're going to take a break for like 15, 20 minutes. And then we'll come back and do issue six. We're going to put food in our faces. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. We'll probably do like half. We're not hangry. Yeah. Probably like half an hour. We'll, we'll still be uh, Back back when you uh, first started making bubbles, Jody. Yeah. Dave said, hover bubble, hover bubble above the bubble. And try and say that hover bubble five times fast. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Hover bubble <clears throat> above the bubble. Hover bubble 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 above the bubble. Yeah. That's, that's huh. a nice. weird robot. That's what you are. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's everyone's favorite part? Oh, no. Mm. My favorite part was that they <laughs> You did. It, you chose to initiate a chase scene, which I wasn't expecting you to do at all. And then I got to use some cards that I wrote out five weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite part is discovering how to interact with chat too late into the series. <laughs> nice. I like doing the plane just peered around us. Like that was like a really okay. great. Like yeah, I'm aware. That was really cool to me. Good. I had a tremendous amount of fun, of fun whacking a puce pigeon in the <laughs> sleep puce. Uh, these two. So the entire arc of all these like the little beggars you fought came out after the first. We, we thought of Paisley Pews first. Yeah. Because of the yeah. first, <laughs> the first session after the first session, yes. and I'm like, oh my god, we have to do it. Yep. I love <laughs> and it. so then, <laughs> that generated a lot of yep. uh, hilarious things. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of our plans. That's good. 
I'm real sad it, we didn't get to use my other song. Right. Yet. Oh, right. It got requested, so it's fine. It's still oh, on the list. Nice. Okay. It's going to be. Somebody else gonna requested be it We'll see also. it again yeah. later. All right. All right. So we'll be back in about 20 minutes. Sure. 20 no, minutes on good. It every time he says it. <laughs> 10, 17 30, minutes. 90 minutes. Uh, no, 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 not minutes. that. Not that. We'll be 16 back eventually. minutes. No, it'll be, it'll be about uh, 15 minutes. It'll be about 25 minutes. <laughs> and approximately half an hour, maybe 20 minutes, we'll be back. It's 10 minutes from now, we'll see you then. Well, maybe send out a tweet. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> but it